the video and it's been a minute since I dropped the video on this channel. Um, but I'm trying to get back into it. I'm back, trying to get back dropping videos. Uh, if you're new, subscribe, hit the notification oh, bell. And yes, so I got me a new um griddle so I can cook some pancakes on here, some bacon, eggs, whatever I want to cook on here. I do want to see if I can um see how high they get to see if I can like you know put some um hamburgers on here or something like that other than like you know breakfast food. So I got this and I also um I'm unboxing this today. This is the electric skillet. So I'll be cooking some chicken. Um yeah, got some I'll put some you know. Put the whole lot of stuff with this. Put some chicken in there, vegetables and everything. So yeah. So yeah, let me um, go and take this out of the box. Stay tuned. Okay, y'all. Uh, I'm about to um, take this out. The um, this the griddle. Taking this out the box right now. cooking I already got a waffle maker so I've been like you know instead of me like um actually buying waffles the ones that's already made I'm gonna be making waffles from scratch because it's better it tastes a lot better than the ones that you buy from the, in the box that's pre-made So I guess this is um this whole thing just get hot. I thought okay, I lock it in. I guess I take it out. It's a lot. I guess I can see. I don't know what that is right there. It's like a lot. And here's the plug that goes with it. Comes with it. I do want to see how hot it is. Maybe I continue the video before I drop the video and um cook something on it. I guess I will turn it this way. Okay, so look, this thing right here lights up. So right now it's off and it goes up to 400. Okay, so that is real hot. So I can put it at 150, 200, depends on how hot I need it. So basically that's tight as an oven. So I definitely probably can cook some burgers on here. And some pork chops, and I ain't eat, I don't eat no pork chop no more. But I can probably fry some um, bologna on here, some turkey. So I'm, right now, I'm, I'm gonna put it at 300. Actually, I'm gonna put it at 250 because I don't need it that high. I'm gonna put some bologna, um, put some turkey on here or whatever. So I'm gonna let it heat up. So I got that on right now. I'm about to unbox the electric skillet and hook this up. Let's see.
cooking. All right, about some chicken. I'm about to cook. Um, I'm gonna start on that until um tomorrow. So I probably won't drop the video until tomorrow. I probably y'all probably won't see this video until Friday. Today is Thursday. Top. Cooking my chicken, putting some um, vegetables inside there, chopping some peppers with this, and yeah, we're gonna be eating good. Eat some cornbread, some mac and cheese on the side. I mean, let's go see how um the skip the um, griddle is doing right now. Well, then that's hot. That's real hot. Let me try to put some on here. Hold on. That's hot, hot. Just some um, turkey or whatever, some turkey breasts. I'm about out of do some, but I got another pack in now. Let me see some. Hold on, let me spray some butter on now. Oh, the butter over here, y'all. Got some Pam original butter. <laughs> Actually, I use this for my um, I use this right here for the uh, waffle maker. But I'm gonna use it over here. I'm gonna use it for this too. See it smoking. Okay, so I'm gonna um, yeah, it's sizzling. Y'all hear it? Make my son a good old turkey and cheese sandwich. Okay. That is hot. And look, I only got, I just got it on 250 right now. I'm about to flip it now, y'all. And I'm gonna put his cheese on. Put the cheese on it. Oh. I might not even have to flip it. We might cook it all the way through um, the front and the back. All right, I'm about to lay the cheese on now. Oh, I got oh, this thing cooked pretty good. I need to give me a spatula instead of using a spoon. I mean, it's fork. I'm not gonna put no um cheese on that one. Yeah, that cooked it real good. Mm 
y'all so i'm impressed with this right here so you know y'all probably wonder like okay why she, why she got the boxes or whatever i keep the boxes i'm gonna start keeping the boxes on stuff for at least 30 days uh 30 to um 60 days just in case something happened to the um the product and i got the receipt as well and i can put everything back in the box so as far as um it, this the vacuum cleaner being good this right here well i had um i had bought another one but i had to re um get this this is new right here so the one i did have previously I had went broke and i bought this one but i'm gonna keep the box for this and the receipt so just in case something happened to it i can return it and i got i got the box and everything with it this been doing me real good. The vacuum been doing me real good. I'm impressed with this right here because it gets super hot. It gets real hot. And I only had it on 250. So I'm going to try this tomorrow when I start on the chicken. I already got the chicken refrigerator to um, be thawing. And I got the vegetables and whatever. I take that out tomorrow. So I'm going to be cooking some, chopping some peppers up, uh, seasoning the chicken and putting it all in here. I should have brought some potatoes. That would have um, been good too. But yeah, that's why I got all this right here. Y'all see all the packages and whatever. I just got it just in case um the products you know act up or whatever and I can return it within 30 days or whatever. So yeah, I try this tomorrow. And I love my waffle maker. I got um, my all this right here. If y'all ain't watch my shorts, I make like um different types of waffles, uh, pan uh, Oreo waffles. I just recently made a um Dorito and chip waffle and whatever, and it was good. You find fairy chips. And um, just chop it in there, chop it in the bowl, um, the mix, and then you'd uh, eat it. I mean, I like this. I'm going to make some tomorrow when my, when my son goes to school. I'm going to cook him some bacon, some sausage links, some eggs. Probably do some pancakes or he might do the waffle again. I don't know. But um, I'm going to be using this tomorrow um, for my son cooking his, um, cooking his breakfast to take to school. But anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more. Like the video. And yes, um, well, hold on. I did tell y'all I was going to do this, so I might um, still continue to do this, and I'll drop the video Friday. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. What's up, y'all? This is the next day. This is Friday, where I'll be dropping this video. Um, I'm cooking my son some breakfast for school, so he'll be taking his breakfast. He takes his breakfast to school. I cook it, and he takes it to school, so he won't be eating um, the... Uh, the school breakfast because they don't really be serving that much. I don't know. It don't be a big breakfast. I don't feel like so. I cook my son a good old nice breakfast so he can um start his like day off with a nice breakfast, good old breakfast. So he got sausage links right here, bacon. Right now I'm working on the um the waffles. So I gotta cut um break the egg, put that in there, mix this up, and then I already got the um the waffle maker warming up. Okay, that's getting hot right now. That's already hot and ready. So that's cooking. I'm gonna be working on the waffles. So right now I got the um, skillet heating up, the electric skillet heating up. I think I'm think um, I'm gonna go by like I'm trying I'm not trying to fry the chicken. I'm trying to like more so bake it. So I think I'm gonna put a little bit of grease in there. 
And yeah, because this is my first time actually trying to do this. So I'm trying to do this on the first go correctly. So let me know if I'm doing this right. I'm trying to put a little bit of grease. Oh, should I put one? Um, I know when I'm baking it, when I'm doing it in the oven, it's different from when you do it. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be the same thing. Hopefully, it turned out right. I'm going to put a little bit of grease right here. Right now, I'm about to season the chicken. I already washed it. Like I've seen, I already washed the chicken. I have to season it. Here's the vegetable oil that I'm probably going to put in there. Put it in here. Right now, I got it on 350. Heating up on 350. I guess when it's ready, it's going to turn out. Green, but I don't want it too hot. So I want it. I want it to cook slow, but fast enough, slow enough for it to cook all the way through. Y'all know what I mean. This so it can cook like inside and the outside can cook just you know right, like it's supposed to. So I got it on 350. Maybe I should put it. I don't know if I should put it on 350 or three between 300 and 350. I have to put it right there. Oh, 300 to 350. And then put a little bit of grease in now. It's our, ooh, it's already getting a little hot. And let me go and season this chicken and yeah. I don't know what it is, but pepper makes me sneeze. I'm just trying to, I'm trying to hold my sneeze in. If I got a sneeze, I turn, turn, um, turn the other way. Season, uh, got the chicken season now. I'm just waiting for that to heat up. I'm trying to see, I was trying to do like a little vegetable thing, like cook, um, putting the chicken in there and the vegetables. I don't know, unless I should cook the chicken first and then put the vegetables. I don't know, we're gonna see. I don't know. Okay, y'all, so I put the grease in there for some reason. The grease is like moving around, like I, at least I got these things right here to where I can move the grease around, but it seems like it's gonna fry it. I don't know, let's see. That's the case. I might need to put some more grease. This is gonna be a fail. I got. I think this is gonna be a fail. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. You think this is gonna be a fail? So I ain't. Is this um? Is this frying it? If it's frying it, then um, I have supposed to put some flour on this. So it ain't gonna turn out right. Can you fry chicken without no flour? I mean, can you fry chicken without flour? Okay, so I guess I'm um. Let's hop right here, hold on. They're cooking right now. Oh, that means, hold on. Y'all, that means if I was trying to boil it, maybe I should just put water on it if I just wanted to boil chicken. Because this, I don't know if it's going to turn out right. Because most times when I'm frying some chicken and I haven't fried chicken in a minute, most times when I'm frying some chicken, I'm putting some flour on the chicken. I don't know. But I've, I've never known anybody to fry chicken without any bread or um, whatever. So I don't know how this is going to turn out. Y'all, the chicken itself is actually looking good because I wasn't really going for crispy. I don't want no crispy chicken, like no fried chicken. 
I wanted more so like baked chicken, so it's actually coming out to where, to where I wanted it to look. So, and I'm gonna have my vegetables, I'm gonna cook my vegetables, and yeah, we're gonna be in now. Y'all, the chicken is cooked, it's nice and um, it ain't crispy because I didn't have the um, flour. If I would have used the flour, it would have been crispy. But I wasn't going for crispy, as I told y'all in the previous clip. I wanted it to be like a bait type, you know, boiled um, type chicken. And it's thoroughly cooked. I took a piece of chicken already. It ain't red, it ain't bleeding. It ain't pink or anything. It's white, chicken white, chicken looking good, T tastes good. I'm about to start on the... Um, the California blend, which is we got broccoli, carrots, and I'm about to put it in the same thing. I've already cleaned out all the oil and put it in that other pot. Got I still some fresh grease over there. So I cleaned out the um the uh, skillet. I'm now about to put some water to see how it does with the vegetables. So I'm gonna put some water in here. I'm gonna cook the vegetables inside of here as well. So stay tuned. All right, y'all. Now that I have the broccoli, the blended um vegetables inside of um this uh. The skillet, so I have it on 250. So I'm gonna slow, I'm trying to slow cook it. I don't want to cook it too fast or whatever. I'm trying to uh, slow cook the vegetables. So yeah, stay tuned.